Hi everyone, hope everyone's well. Um, welcome to my tutorial on using a Knitting Nancy, also called um, a spool knitter, French knitter. They've all got similar terms for doing the same thing. And basically what they do is they make eye cords out of your yarn and the pegs on the top of the spool itself. And then the eye cord comes out at the bottom, a hole just there. I'm using quite a thick yarn for mine. It's a three millimeter recycled cotton. So I'm only going to use two of my four pins. If I had a thinner, like a DK yarn, I'd probably use all four. So what we're going to do to start with, we're just going to um, put the yarn down the center of the hole and it comes out at the bottom. And then I'm just going to hold that in place just for a few minutes. And now you've got your yarn in the middle here. And I'm going to use the front um, pin and the back pin for my two. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to go clockwise around the first one and then go around the back of the second one and then come back round the first one. So it's like a figure of eight. If you can see the middle there, I've got a figure of eight. So I'll just do that again. So at the front, let's just do it like this. You go round that one and then do a figure of eight around the second one. So I've got an eight and then literally just put it just around the front one again. And then you're going to take your little pick. Mm. This is the pick that I normally use here crochet hook will do the job as well and literally you're going to take it the bottom one over the top and then pull tight down below pulling tight is really really important because it keeps them all nice and secure and then I'm literally just going to turn and hold on to my yarn and again take the bottom one over the top and pull tight Turn it again and over, keeping the bottom one on and pull tight. Looks like I can't go any tighter, any um, thicker yarn than this one, mm -hmm. otherwise, it will just sort of jam up, which is not what you want, really. See, it's quite stiff there. We go and pull. And that is literally all you do. You just keep going and going like that. Keep pulling it down. You can't see much there at the moment, but um, as I get out the bottom, I'll show you a little bit more. So round and then over and pull tight. And as you get a bit more sort of proficient at it, you will get quicker at it. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to I'll knit it down to the bottom so you can see how it looks. Oop, around there. And then over. Pull. Round. Over. All right, so I'm going to come back in a few minutes when I've got some of my eye cord coming out the bottom there. Okay, so I'm just going to, just going to do a bit more here. And I'll come back so you can see how it looks. There we go. Okay, so I've made quite a long um, eye cord. It's going to probably going to be made into a necklace, an adjustable one. But you can see how small that is for my yarn. If I measure that quickly, it's literally... about half a centimeter um, wide so it's quite a small one so what we're going to do now is we're going to bind off and again there's a few ways that you can do this so that's what it looks like on top now there we go and here's my working yarn here so all I'm going to do is I'm going to cut about a foot from the edge Okay, so here's my end. 
and I just literally need to take off these live stitches and make them secure. And again, there's a few ways that you can do this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pick in the first stitch and grab my wool. This bit's quite tricky. You could also just use a needle um, just to sew them. And then I'm going to bring it through and just literally take that off and then turn and then do exactly the same with the other one through the through the stitch bring the yarn up and through and then just take it off and then I can pull the whole thing through okay there's my spool knitter and then you can just literally pull on that end just to secure it and that's not going anywhere. Same with the other end, just going to secure that just by pulling it as well. And that is how you make a small knitted knitting Nancy just on two pegs, an eye cord which you can make into other things and gifts and accessories. Um, hope you found that useful and I look forward to seeing you on my next iCord inspiration. Take care, have a good day, bye.